happy Friday. It's Herbless Viola. You see that it is raining outside and I got company. Yeah, see, I got little guests. You see, I got little guests. That's Teddy and Scotty. They're back there playing. So I got some. So today, family, I want to just talk about, you know, because they're not going to talk about how you to build your immunity. They're not going to tell you that. So I just want to talk about the cold pack. Yeah, I already know a cold pack that I use in college and just in general with your children and with you. Imagine what's, I can imagine what's sitting in your desk right now. If you're at your office, I want you to pull and look at your, your desk versus my cold pack. So I want to introduce my cold pack. And my cold pack is an arsenal that everybody should have. I'm telling you, you should have this on your kitchen counter. You should be, you know, putting stuff up in a jar. Because <laughs> look, look at my cold pack. You got lemon, you got honey, oranges, cinnamon, and ginger. This is a powerhouse cold pack that everybody should have. I'm telling you, soups, just drinks, hot teas, and two essential oils I could think of right now. Black pepper and peppermint essential oil will be dynamite with this cold pack. And you can just add. I'm going to go over different herbs you can have. That's going to be part of my series. But I just want to touch bases and just tell you, I don't like your cold pack. Because the only thing I would say on your cold pack that I see is the honey. And I don't know if that's the the raw, un, un touched honey like from the honeycomb because some of this honey out here is fake and it's got so much added sugar but that manuka honey and the real honey that you get from the farm or straight from our you know a person who actually gets it straight from the bees that's the honey that we should be having but i just wanted to show you my cold pack versus your cold pack and the only reason why i said it because on this tv they are not gonna tell you about how to build your your immunity because they should, you know, we're looking at TV and we're in this dimmick and we're not really teaching you about different cold packs and which one to use. Cause like I said, what's in your drawer right now? What's on your counter? You know, I see things that is nothing but sugar, sugar, sugar. That's feeding them parasites instead of using some natural stuff. And the only thing I know you don't see water, but of course we want to add things to this cold pack, not take away. Cause a lot of stuff that y'all got, if y'all look at y'all cold pack, a lot of that stuff I need to be taken away because you it, look when it goes in your body, it's not giving your body nutrients. It's not feeding the good gut bugs. It's not feeding your microbiome. What it's feeding is giving you inflammation instead of making your body a little bit more balanced. And like I said, it's acid. It's really putting more acidity in your body instead of leveling it to where the alkaline is more alkaline. It's really tweaking your body and making your body get rid of those free radicals and making you you know go do number one and number two let's go ahead and say that or detoxifying your body and getting rid of those free radicals that's you know messing up in our 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 cells and wreaking havoc in our body and we need something that's gonna you know cleanse our blood cleanse our body something pure something natural instead of this other fake stuff that we have that just deaden our senses make our body lazy and make us worse to where we're not sleeping right the fever's not breaking because we already know we should be starving a fever and feeding a cold you look at this cold pack it's a good arsenal to soothe your ailing body especially with this season we're coming up on the sea flu and season flu i can't even say it we're coming up on the the flu and cold season if not you know you're already seeing how people got pneumonia and we're in the the perfect vitamin d environment with this sun but if you're staying inside and and you're not cleaning things and not airing out your house and not wiping things down <laughs> Tea tree oil, tea tree oil. Don't use the other stuff. But just to say that because I just want to make sure you're building your immune system, keeping your immune system strong because it's all about keeping your immune system strong. And I want to touch on two essential oils. And like I said, this is a series. I will be adding uh, different things to this cold pack that you guys can use. Since I'm showing you a powerhouse cold pack, I'm going to show you different herbs you can use. Like I know... I'm always recommending, you know, Mama D, Purple Sage, Healthy Living, her cayenne pepper, which would be a powerhouse in some water by itself. But if you look at each and every one of these items, like the ginger, the the 
the lemon, which I would put, I would like switch out and add maybe a couple of key limes in there. You know, that lime is, is no joke. That's a powerhouse too. You know, you can make your fresh orange juice, fresh lemon juice, you know, lemon, some cinnamon. And all this is can be by itself or together, juiced by together. Use the pulp, eat the pulp, make sure you're getting some fiber. But I'm just saying like the two essential oils is black pepper and peppermint essential oils. Cause we're talking about reducing and having l less mucus, having less inflammation in your body. And these both like dry it out helps with antiviral. So you're going to be seeing these slides and all this stuff. Cause who wants to walk around with phlegm and congestion? You want to relieve that. And this also, you know, helps with relieving of pain and a whole other things, aid in digesting. Because sometimes our stomach is queasy and we're like, oh my goodness, should I put some food on my belly? No, make you some tea, make you some soup. You do not have to eat food. You could just take this natural powerhouse that's right in front of you and make you some soup and build your immune system. And this is the cold pack that you should have versus that cold pack that they're, you know, that I'm putting on the screen right now, that I'm putting on the screen right now. Y'all know the cold pack. Cause like I said, open your drawer right now and look at your cold pack versus my cold pack. I'm just saying, I'm just saying. So if y'all really want to build your immunity and get your immunity system strong, this is what you need. This is the powerhouse you need, you know, cause most of this stuff is, like I said, is in that fire cider. You know, I know a lot of people do elderberry, which is great, but I'm just saying having something that you could just have right now, this powerhouse that you can use and just take care of yourself. You know, like I said, you can add different herbs, you know, like here you could put green tea, you can have spirulina, you know, put that in some water. You can have some, you know, some, uh, bilberry, you can have some, uh, lemon palm which is good because people don't realize sometimes they have anxiety and you could say ashwagandha. I just want to make sure that I just touch bases and, you know, we, you know, want to make sure I live a good, good, you know, so we want to make sure you have dandelion and burdock root. But and on, on occasion, yes, I would put garlic on the side, but look, I'm just talking about this cold pack and I know I'm going way out the way, but I'm going to introduce this. It's just going to be a start of a series because I want you to just have this in your arsenal have this on your kitchen counter, have this on your, your table, instead of having a little ornament, put this up here. So you'll always go to, this could be your go-to thing. And you can put this in your, um, in your office at your, on your desk, have people, you know, say, oh yeah, I can use that lemon. Oh, I can go ahead and take some of that, that ginger, cut a piece and put in some water and let it sit or, or juice it. It's so many things, so many different recipes that you can have and i'm going to show you the recipes in other in other videos but i just want to show you my cold pack versus your cold pack so i just want you to switch the cold pack yes switch the cold pack because y'all know which one is better and which one is is more better for your body but all right fam <laughs> all right fam this herb is viola i'm going to go play with the puppies <laughs> before they leave bye <laughs> Thank you.